the doctor has to, you know, the problem is that you know, he wants to be thorough with everybody, and it just backs up. But for the most part, you know, well, it's he, nice that he takes time. Well, oh, he does, right. and they, they love that when it's third term. Mm -hmm. But when it's not third term, they for it, sure. back. Absolutely. The, but the other thing is, he, he sees about anywhere between forty and fifty a day. On average, that's yeah, pretty good. Yeah, that's no, it's pretty good. Close, busy. It's good enough for us. All right, it's a, a lot. This is the this is the lobby. And then we come in here and start to ask the, uh, the girls in there. That's the area. No, that's okay. That's just your uh, reception. There's a patient room over here. There's a patient right now. Okay. These, these, these patient these rooms. Are closed. Or... So three patient rooms here. Oh, yeah, there's a, a patient room over there. Oh. So this is our this is our lab. Oh, not a patient room. This is where we do blood draw. Okay, good. All that good. stuff. Good, good. Good for research. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we do a lot of stuff. So in here. So everything calibrated? Every, yeah, your buddy. He was just here last week. Uh, Kevin Anderson? Yes. Uh huh? Did yeah. he actually? Did he just bring a laptop? No, he actually he went around this time. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe because he doesn't know me. Okay. Yeah. But he came in here and uh, did five hundred bucks worth of stuff. It was like All right. Twenty or thirty things. Like that. Yeah. At twenty bucks a pop. Yeah. He charges per item. Mm hmm. Right. Yeah, he was good. Here. He was here. Excellent. Like, was like and then last week. Looks like you're set up to have a crash cart, kind of maybe. Oh, we have a crash cart. Yeah, crash cart room. We have, we have a locked up room because it's got drugs in it. Sure. Also very good. Mm -hmm. All right. Good. There's a patient in here. This is a in this That's room. A patient here, room. Okay. Yeah. There's a, and then there's one in there. But uh, we, in that room there, we've got um, therapy equipment as well. Mm -hmm. We have a roller bed for massage back. For, mm -hmm. and we also have. A, Electrical stimulation, mm -hmm. all different kinds of equipment for personal injury stuff that we do. Okay, excellent. Okay. And this is our lock room. Okay. Where we keep medications for stuff like that. Can you show it? Yeah. <laughs> I assume this would be where you store medication for research. Yes. Okay. We're gonna. I, we're going to uh, get some of the stuff out of here. I have a little refrigerator at this spot, a locker and refrigerator as well. Let's kind of go in here. You actually found a refrigerator that locks? Yeah. Because uh, I've always had to do that manually, set something up. Oh, I'll show it to you. It's in the room over there. All right. So a lot of this stuff's going to come out here, and the refrigerator is going to go right here. Okay. It's a little guy. So do you have a locking cabinet you could put in here? Yeah, I have a metal one. Okay, good. Yeah, it's That's locking. Right yeah, locking lock. metal cabinet. Okay, good. And uh, and the refrigerator too. Okay, good. And the metal cabinet is about the eight big, so it'll go up against here. We'll lock it. The little fridge will go over here. Excellent, perfect. And this, this is also double locked. Okay. They they typically want to see that you can lock the drug in a Absolutely. in the room. No, yeah, we, we got you know you guys give us a list mm. when we when we first. technically that does qualify. They're still going to take it. Oh no, we're going to it'll, it'll be on top of that. All right. It's one of those uh, side by side. Opening doors with a lock on yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the doctor went one extra step. It was his personal lock on the cabinet. Okay. He also put a chain on it. <laughs> Very nice. Yeah, it's fire. This is one of this is the patient restroom. This is another patient room. So not only will it show up. Oh, it says EKG. Do you have the oh, we used to keep that in here. It's okay. in the other room right now. Okay. So you do have one? We do, yeah. We have EKG here. Good. So, and I'm going to have these things all the way to post it. It's time. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice setup. And then this next room here, this is where we keep our biohazard and some of our other stuff, but it's more of a storage closet right now. And biohazard's back in the, that trash can in there. So, do you have more storage area? Mm hmm. Like that you can utilize that's, you know, the yeah. whole attic? Is a storage spot that we use. Yeah, you can get up there relatively easily. Right through here, we pop this off, and then it's it's tall enough for me to stand up. Okay. And then this is a this is our our okay, so I'll file. All right. And this is where we used to keep some meds, but uh, now it's just for the girls. So are all of those used? I assume they are. All of them full. And we actually have more. So I only see one issue for a, a research perspective. Mm -hmm. That's your storage capability, right? So when you get busy, um, you're gonna have a lot of binders, right? Right. And 
mean, you can you can do the binders however you'd like, but they prefer three ring binders, so mm -hmm. the three inch ones. Right. Yeah. Um, and if you're really busy, you might have 50 of those or 100 of those, right? Mm -hmm. 100 three inch binders. Right. Um, 200, right? If you're busy. Um, and then you're going to get a lot of lab kits. They come in a box about yay big. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then you're going to get shipping containers that are about this size. Okay. So the shipping containers, you probably have 40 or 50 of those. Lab kits that are you know, this yay size, mm -hmm. you probably have maybe 75 of those. Okay. So between the binders and the boxes, uh, do you have a place to store those? But other than there. Oh, we could put them in here. You know, I could. Uh, the only reason I say that is because. How big of an everything I'll need? The shipping containers you can put up there, no issue. Mm -hmm. Okay, but everything else you probably have to store down here. Okay. The binders, the lab kits. How about right behind you? I build that. I can build that into a shelf, a double sided shelf. Yeah, lab kits maybe there. Mm -hmm. um, and I could bring this down here, and then make two shelves. Yeah, that and could then work. I over here too. Yeah, that could work. Yeah, yeah. That's easy enough. I just built all this. Okay. Because we actually had and these were all sitting in boxes, like you know, those 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 box, bank boxes that pull out. Right. And it just became a pain in the butt. Yeah. So I bought all these and built this out literally three months ago. Mm -hmm. So I can do the same thing across here. I wouldn't go too extravagant until you have a study in place, right? So get a study. They're not gonna, for one study, they're not gonna take issue. But once you have some things here and you start right. getting more studies, they'll come and say, well, we're gonna store our stuff. Sure, no, I'm with you. So I'd wait till you have a anyway, study. It, it, it takes me a couple hours to do it and it's, right. it's freaking easy. All right. And very inexpensive. I think I, I think I paid about 150 bucks for sure. all this stuff. Sure. It's nothing. It's just I was thinking more of the top, but it yeah, doesn't take you long. I figure no big deal. Screw right. sawdust and screw gun. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. All right. Sounds good. Sounds good. But, uh, yeah, then I, oh, oh, there you go. Cool. Yeah. And then I'll show you all this other side over here. Oh yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. The uh, this side is where uh, Francesca. Uh, this is the doctor's office over here. Yeah, I just. Uh, and then Francesca. Go ahead, keep on going. This is her little area over here. Right, and I see you. So this is where Francesca sits over here and does her stuff. Okay. And this is the refrigerator I was talking about. See, the lock on the bottom. Yeah. Put it on the other side. Interesting. Amazon, two hundred bucks. Yeah, not bad. Yeah, it works on any already. A freezer. You have a sub-zero freezer. Don't have it yet. So that uh, I can get any time on Amazon. Yeah, uh, and that's definitely where I would recommend. You can get one minus 20 for like 200 bucks. Mm -hmm. You can go anywhere else, 2,000, 4,000, yeah, right. it's ridiculous. No, I want Amazon. Yeah, it's 200 bucks. <laughs> I'm not picky on brands. Right. But yeah, I can get that. And they're kind of small, right? Yeah, they're about that, a little smaller than that actually. Yeah, perfect. About two thirds that size. And do I need to have that or wait until we get a study? No, I, you know, for 200 bucks, I would get it now. Just get it now, okay, yeah. perfect. Yeah. yeah, so that will actually go in there, in that side of the room over there I was talking about showing you mm -hmm. with that, we'll have them side by side, and stack them on top of each other. Yeah, um, yep, yep, that's exactly how we have it arranged too. Perfect. Okay, so that's the, that's, that's pretty much it. This bathroom right here, we have a shower in here. So we have to have a study where there's a shower. Uh, I wish we had a shower. <laughs> I already modeled our office. Mm -hmm. I thought about putting a shower in. Oh, yeah. I would have. Yeah, I thought about it. So it's totally regretted now because, oh, because I'm a one you wouldn't be able to do it here you know, in the States, but you have to have a shower and do it only in the Right. Like, that's what we've heard about. I don't think we want to get into that. Right. You, you wouldn't. Not with the space that you have here, right? Oh, uh, yeah, but my We have a space. Uh, yeah. I would have. So there was a couple of studies we lost out on for that reason. Yeah. Get one of, you got to get one of those, those camp showers. Yeah, right? Yeah. They actually wouldn't let, allow that because I suggested that. Yeah. Yeah. Put a box into the Home Depot and get one of those. And there's a hotel right across the street. I said, well, we'll just rent a room and go over there and shower. They wouldn't do it. They wouldn't allow that either. Yeah, they're really picky. That sucks. So, so yeah, I'm going to... For the uh, the storage space up there, because yeah. normally we we have a we have a, a ladder we just crawl up in there. Mm -hmm. But I'm gonna get one of those fold downs mm -hmm. so we can just walk up and down. Good. Yeah. Find to put the 
shipping boxes up there, and that takes up most of the room. Those okay. shipping boxes, because again, there were like three feet by a foot. Gotcha. So no, yeah. So I think it was, it was uh, Francesca that told me about that. And up there, it's a huge. We store so much different junk up there. Everything that we don't use, it goes up there. Yeah. Just when you have somebody that come, finally comes out for a site selection visit, just tell them. Show me. I'll show it. You don't need to show them. Just say up there is where we store like shipping boxes. Gotcha. Just yeah, so they don't have questions about that. Yeah. yeah, excellent. Yeah. All right. Excellent. Cool. Looks good. Yeah.